Hello, I'm Nassau County District Court Judge Colin O'Donnell, and it's my privilege to be here to represent the Grenville Baker Boys and Girls Club and award the scholarships from the club. On behalf of the scholarship committee, it's, part, it's my privilege to be a part of this awards program. Since 1975, Grenville Baker Boys and Girls Club has proudly awarded college scholarships to deserving high school seniors who are active club members, serve their community, and plan to attend college in the fall. This year, the committee is fortunate to award a total of $23,000, and that's through the financial generosity of many members of our community who we acknowledge and thank. Over the past 45 years, the club has awarded hundreds of thousands of dollars to ensure that our club kids have the opportunity to achieve their college goals and become responsible citizens. Each year, the committee is always impressed with the, the quality of the scholarship applicants and their achievements continue to make the committee's final decision more difficult as they are all worthy of recognition. This year was no exception as each should be proud of their accomplishments and we are grateful for their commitment to the Grenville Baker Boys and Girls Club and our community. And we are confident that each of you will continue to be successful. This year, we're awarding four scholarships. The first scholarship is in the name of Susan Ely. The Susan Ely Memorial Scholarship celebrates the life of a former member of our board of directors who was an artist, photographer, and active community volunteer. In 1997, her family endowed a scholarship in her memory. This year's award recipient is, a, is planning to attend Hofstra in the fall, major in business. She was an active Keystone member of the Boys and Girls Club, which is our service program. And she was a stage manager in the high school drama program. This year's award recipient of the Susan Ely Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $2,000 is Julianne Zambuto. Congratulations. Our next scholarship is the Bernard E. Patterson Memorial Scholarship, which is awarded in honor of the memory of a club father and volunteer who tragically lost his life on September 11th at the World Trade Center. Bernie Patterson exemplified integrity, loyalty, and service, and we recognize him by honoring a young person who's given back to their community. This year's recipient plans to attend SUNY Cortland and was a Keystone member was a cheerleader and that recipient of the Bernie Patterson Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $2,000 is Ashley Martinez. Congratulations. Our next award recipient is an individual who's gonna be receiving the John Stenisi Memorial Scholarship. Steno, as he was fondly remembered by his friends and alumni, was part of the Locust Valley High School graduating class of 1979 and was previously an outstanding athlete at Grenville Baker. Steno was all county third baseman at Locust Valley High School who went on to play baseball at the University of Bridgeport. Tragically, he passed away in 2015. And in his memory, close friends decided to create a scholarship that would honor his memory as a club alumnus. This year's award recipient is attending Hofstra University in the fall plans to major in medicine and participate in the physician's assistance program. Her club memories are those in the art room and of summer camp. And this year's award of $1,000 for the John Stenisi Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Ashley Capozzi. Congratulations. Our final scholarship is in the memory of Gary Glowax, which was endowed by our community volunteers and board members Connie and Mark Lowitz. That award is going to be awarded to an individual who was attending Ithaca College in the fall, majoring in film, was an active member of the club's Keystone program, was a var varsity soccer player, and the amount of $5,500, the Gary Glowatz Memorial Scholarship is awarded to Jimmy Mejia. Congratulations to all the graduates of 2020 and thank you for allowing Grenville Baker Boys and Girls Club to be part of your community and this celebration. Thank you.